where I talk about all kinds of edible things, also tropical, subtropical, ornamental things. I have a food forest in Central Florida, and I hope you subscribe. Today, I just decided to go on an adventure and drive down Route 1 along the Indian River, which <laughs> I just wound up here. And I saw a really cool place I wanted to uh, check out on the way down south to another fruit tree nursery, which I'm hoping to live stream, stream from as well, down in uh, Wabasso. I'm about halfway there on my trip and uh, found this cool little Penjing Bonsai Garden. It's just right off of Route 1. Super cool. So I asked the uh, Nice guy I met in there. If it was okay if I live stream, he thought it would be fine. This place is super cool. I don't really know much about about bonsai trees, really. I'm um, looking around here, and I can already see a few things that are super cool. Dragon fruit, of course, on the fence. Nice touch. That looks like a emerald bamboo, probably. I'm gonna say hard to say but I'm gonna put say that's emerald so that's a quality pick for a bamboo already seeing some good indicators a little fruit tree there probably a lemon or key lime yeah also let me know if you have any questions as I go through because uh, I can always pass them on anyway this is the place where I'm at. If you come by and visit them, say hi. Hey, Merry Business. Check it out. Isn't that cool? Foxtail and a sable palm blowing in the breezes. Alright, let's go in. Wow. Really beautiful. Koi Pond. Look at that. Oh, that's really cool. I think they call that a Vietnamese carp. That one on the bottom there. Look at how many small fish, too. Whoa, there's a snake directly on that. You see that? That snake? I think it land right in there. Wow, that's nuts. Well, I think I won't go too close to the snake, but that is super cool. He's got a little bow in his head there, so I'm not sure he's not poisonous. All right, we keep moving. Hello. How are you? Great. Thanks for letting me live stream. Look at this. This is like a whole area of new, new things for me. He specializes in all bonsai trees. I can already feel it. I'm probably going to have to buy one. <laughs> How cool is that? Bonsai pine tree. Bonsai like... I'm not going to say it's a slash pine because I don't know. I can ask. It's interesting to me just to see what kinds of things he does bonsai. Bardra. Okay, yeah, you can see how the... I love to trim things. i got a, actually a lot of trimming videos on the channel. And uh, this bonsai appeals to me. I'm just curious to see what kinds of things are being bonsai. Bougainvillea. Mm, that makes sense. It's a really cool idea. Florida bonsai. I mean, here are a bunch of things that are. larger. 
bamboos. The juniper. This looks more like a classic bonsai to me. I like that. Is super cool. It's like a little juniper. Interesting. Ah, little elm trees. these are these tamarind trees no way I'm really curious what these are no they're not tamarind trees Cardboard plant. Get knocked over. That is cool. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what, incredible selection of things. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that. Get to see the long-term result. Hey James Tropicals, I'm in a bonsai nursery. Walking around checking it out, I really don't know anything about bonsai trees, although I do know many of the things that are growing here. I've never seen them grown like this. It's the elm. Oh wow, look at this, Bougainvillea. This is really artistic, the way... Look at that. How cool is that? I can see, it looks like most of the plants that are selected are just really hardy. Of course, love to be trim type plants, just like you would think. The bougainvillea being one of them. You know what's interesting? I don't see a single thorn on here. Because you could just trim all those back as well. That's so cool. Look at this elm. See, I love to tree form things. I tree form odd things that I think are odd to tree form, like sea grapes. And uh, it's like the ultimate in tree forming. Another oleander. This time the white. The white is much, uh, I think, a much hardier grower. Even oh, look at that. It's the perfect starter. Well, this is a sidetrack off the main mission, but I'm really glad I stopped and took a look. It's so nice. Oh, look back there. That looks like the old Persian mulberry tree. I just put three of those in my yard that I grew from cuttings. And they're supposed to be superior mulberries. It's big leaves like that. Usually they're Persian mulberries around here. And uh, they are delicious. That's cool. Looks like we got some volunteers growing on the side. 
these pine trees are so cool. This is giving me so many ideas. But you get your starter, and then you can get it in a dish like this, and then over time, I suppose, try to get it to this level. Oh, how cool. I really, really, really like the look of the juniper as a bonsai. That is so cool. Some larger, so many. Oh, wow. Ficus. Holy moly. Just goes on and on. Japanese yew tree, ficus, more bougainvillea. Look at the roots on the ficus. Some people call it ficus, I don't like it, but this is the way to do it. That's interesting, you can see the roots. It will always be trying to escape. I guess you just have to constantly keep it trimmed back, but I love the aerial roots like that, the pillar roots they call them. Here's an older bougainvillea. Wow, look at the trunk on that. Oh, the coup d'etat. <laughs> wow, you can feel the heat coming off of this greenhouse. It's so warm in here. As soon as I step in, it went up. It feels like 15 degrees. What a beautiful greenhouse, too. Absolutely beautiful. All right, so I'm going to be live streaming again just a little bit later on today. If you're interested, join in my adventure with me. Well, stay tuned. Turn on the notifications because I'm going to be jumping back on when I get down there. Hopefully, if I can get permission to uh, stream when I'm in there. So thanks for jumping on. These are the best bonsai trees I've ever seen. <laughs> this is so fun coming here. I'd recommend you check this out. For sure. Let them know that you saw this on Eat Your Backyard if you do. Okay, thanks for watching. Eat Your Backyard.